Exercise 5. Daria and Farah began a partnership by investing $68,000 and $57,000 respectively. During its first year, the partnership earned $175,000. Prepare calculations showing how the $175,000 income should be allocated to the partners under each of the following three separate plans for sharing income and loss. Letter A, the partners failed to agree on a method to share income. In this case, the income would be allocated evenly, $87,500 to each. Letter B, the partners agreed to share income and loss in proportion to their initial investments. To calculate the proportion, we take each partner's capital balance and divide by total partnership capital, and then multiply by net income. For Daria, the initial investment, $68,000, divided by the sum of 68,000 plus 57,000, and then multiply by net income of 175,000. Daria's share of net income is $95,200. Make sure that you don't round any intermediate calculations. So if we take $68,000 and divide by $125,000, the sum of 68,000 and 57,000, it's 54.4%. We then multiply by $175,000, the amount of net income. Daria's share of income is $95,200. We go through the same process for Farah. Farah's initial investment, $57,000, divided by the sum of Daria and Farah's initial investments, $68,000 plus $57,000 is $125,000, and then multiply by net income, $175,000. 57,000 divided by 125,000 multiplied by 175,000 is $79,800. 95,200 plus 79,800 equals 175,000. Letter C, the partners agreed to share income by granting a $64,000 per year salary allowance to Daria, a $54,000 per year salary allowance to Farah, and 11% on their initial capital investments, and the remaining balance shared equally. So we begin with net income, 175000 and then we calculate the allowances. Salary allowances, Daria, 64000 Farah, 54000 Interest allowances, 11% of Daria's $68,000 initial investment is 7480 11% of Farah's $57,000 investment is $6,270. Total allowances to Daria, $71,480. Total allowances to Farah, $60,270. So the sum of the allowances, $131,750, leaves a balance of income equal to $175,000 $131,750, $45,000. This amount is shared using the partner's profit and loss ratio, which in this case is equal. 50% of 43,250 is 21,625. Daria and Farah will each claim 50% of the balance of income. We now know the amount of income allocated to each partner. For Daria, we take the total of the allowances, 71,480, and add the remainder, 21,625, 93,105. For Farah, we take 60,270, add 21,625, for a total of 81,895. And always make sure that you've allocated total income. 93,105 plus 81,895 equals $175,000.